Merritt Medical offers one of the most comprehensive lines of catheter-directed thrombolysis products on the market. These products are used to deliver therapeutic agents for dissolving blood clots directly at the site of the clot. The Fountain and Mystique infusion catheters are designed to administer various therapeutic solutions into the peripheral vasculature of a patient. They can be used for treatments of peripheral arterial occlusions, dialysis graft declot procedures, as well as treatments for deep vein thrombosis. The setup and use of the Fountain system is straightforward and very simple to do. Both the 4 French and 5 French fountain catheters can be placed over a standard 035 diagnostic guide wire when placing the catheter within the patient's vasculature system. To prep the fountain infusion system, carefully remove all the components from the sterile packaging. All components should be flushed with sterile saline to remove all air prior to insertion into the vascular system. If the clinician is using the squirt fluid dispensing syringe, they will need to prime and debubble the product. To prime the squirt, attach a 20 ml syringe containing saline to the bottom portion of the squirt. Hold the squirt in an upright position and squeeze the trigger bar until all air bubbles are expelled out of the check valve area of the squirt. This may include tapping the squirt fluid path with a hemostat or similar device to dislodge any air bubbles that may be present in the system. The squirt can be rotated during flushing to ensure that all air is displaced from the device prior to connecting to the fountain catheter. The amount of fluid to be dispensed is set using the thumb wheel on the squirt. Volumes can be set from 0.1 mil to 1 mil. If the two syringe setup with check relief valve is used, assemble the products as shown. Use a syringe filled with sterile saline to flush and debubble the components according to standard hospital protocol. If an IV pump is used, the pump must be primed according to the manufacturer's instructions. Tubing sets should also be debubbled and flushed prior to connecting to the fountain catheter. Next, attach the hemostasis valve to the fountain catheter. The hemostasis valve should always be attached to the catheter prior to flushing. To flush the hemostasis valve, attach a syringe to the side port of the valve and gently inject fluid while allowing fluid to fill the entire valve and catheter lumen. The primed fountain catheter and hemostasis valve should then be placed into the patient's vasculature over the diagnostic guide wire, already positioned in the patient. Correct position of the fountain catheter is determined by the clinician using fluoroscopic guidance and visualization. The radiopaque marker bands outlining the infusion segment should be placed within the intended area of the clot that is to be dissolved. The diagnostic guide wire is carefully withdrawn from the patient through the hemostasis valve. The fountain occluding wire is then placed through the hemostasis valve and fed into the fountain catheter. Care should be taken while advancing the occluding wire through the catheter. With the four French fountain system, when the occluding wire has been inserted the full length of the catheter, snap the purple cap of the occluding wire into the back end of the hemostasis valve and tighten down the valve by rotating the fitting clockwise until the valve is completely closed. With the five French fountain system, advance the occluding wire until it stops and does not advance any further into the catheter. This ensures that the wire is correctly placed within the fountain catheter tip. Close the hemostasis valve by rotating the fitting clockwise until the valve is completely closed. Place the provided blue wire protector cap over the exposed portion of the occluding wire to prevent any potential injury from the exposed wire. 
To connect the fountain to the squirt, simply rotate the connector on the squirt while attaching it to the hemostasis valve as shown. To avoid the introduction of air, loosen the hemostasis valve cap and allow a small amount of solution to flow back out of the hemostasis valve. Once fluid has gone through the valve, tighten it back down. To connect the fountain to the two syringes plus check valve setup, attach the check relief valve lure fitting to the hemostasis valve as shown. The 1 mil and 20 mil syringes should already be attached to the check relief valve. To avoid the introduction of air, loosen the hemostasis valve cap and allow a small amount of solution to flow back out of the hemostasis valve. Once fluid has gone through the valve, tighten it back down. To connect the fountain to an infusion pump, simply connect the male lure at the end of the infusion pump tubing to the connector on the hemostasis valve as shown. To avoid the introduction of air, loosen the hemostasis valve cap and allow a small amount of solution to flow back out of the hemostasis valve. Once fluid has gone through the valve, tighten it back down. The 5 French Mystique infusion catheter is designed to be used with a standard guide wire in place and does not require an occluding wire. Attach the hemostasis valve to the Mystique catheter prior to flushing. To flush the hemostasis valve, attach a syringe to the side port of the valve and gently inject fluid while allowing fluid to fill the entire valve and catheter lumen. The mystique is placed into the patient's vasculature over the diagnostic guide wire already positioned in the patient. Correct placement of the mystique catheter is determined by the clinician using fluoroscopic guidance and visualization. The radiopaque marker bands outlining the infusion segment should be placed within the intended area of the cloth that is to be dissolved. The diagnostic guide wire will extend through the back end of the hemostasis valve. Tighten down the valve by rotating the fitting clockwise until the valve is completely closed. The Mystique is now ready for connection to an infusion pump, the squirt fluid dispensing syringe, or the pulse infusion syringes. Merit Medical's therapeutic infusion systems provide clinicians with a superior product for their infusion needs. The proprietary and patented products are designed to provide excellent clinical outcomes for both clinicians and patients with a safe and easy to use system. Fountain and Mystique. Innovations from Merit Medical.